I'm just like the other kids. I'm just like them. Linda Bannon and her son Timmy suffer from a rare condition that left them born without arms. Shirt out or in? Out. But despite their circumstances, the mother and son from Illinois refuse to let their disability stop them from living life to the full. Affecting only 1 in 100,000 people, Linda suffers from Holt-Oram syndrome, which also causes heart problems. But that didn't stop 35-year-old Linda living a normal life growing up. Being born without arms probably, from my perspective, hasn't really affected my life that much because it never really occurred to me growing up that I was that much different than anybody else. In 2003, Linda met future husband Richard, and when she fell pregnant, doctors made the couple aware that any child could be born with Linda's condition. Going through all the checkups that parents go through when they're expecting a baby, we were given the option to terminate the pregnancy, but it was never even a consideration of ours. We want a family. We want to have a baby. Timmy suffered with severe heart problems when he was born. At just eight days old, he was rushed into surgery and spent the first two months of his life in intensive care. But despite his difficult start in life, like his mother, Timmy would not allow his disability to get in the way. Yeah! That was amazing! The pair refuse to wear prosthetic limbs and insist their conditions have never held them back, whether it's cooking, getting dressed <laughs> or playing video games. Oh, I love this one! While Linda does everything she can to maintain her independence, Richard is always ready to help out. I do have to help in the bathroom. Other than that, the other stuff that I help with, she can do herself. But being that I feel like I'm supposed to be helping her, I do them for her, even though I don't necessarily need to. Okay, let's move. Let's move out. At school, Timmy is treated like any other student. I'm just like the other kids. I'm just like them, and I'll be just like them every time of my life. Timmy's personality is such that he gets along with all of his classmates. They accept him for who he is. They play along with each other. I think the kids don't even recognize that Timmy has some special needs. And when school's over, Timmy and Linda are often found at the local pool. I keep afloat by, like, using my butt a little bit and I go under like on my back or on my front. Along with managing Timmy's busy sports schedule and working as a kindergarten teacher, Linda is also hoping to help other people with the same condition. I've been starting up taking business classes in business management with the hope of starting a nonprofit organization to help families of children that are like myself and my son. Linda knows that Timmy will face a difficult future, but is hopeful he will learn to live with his condition and have a happy life just like her. My biggest concern for him is just what will happen if he does not find that companionship because with my husband I have that person that when my parents have gone from this earth I have a person that will look after me and help me and do things for me that my parents used to do. We really hope that he'll find someone. We'll just have to wait and see. Hugged it! Oh no! Oh. Oh. Kicked it too high!